Hello friends, it's Lionheart here, and have I got another deck for you. Released the Siege deck on day one, already in pro rank, and undefeated with it in pro rank, by the way. 4-0, but it counts. However, isn't the deck that got me to pro rank Scoyatel Elf Traps? Yep, you heard me right. It's amazing! Now, we climbed pro with it, had a lot of fun, and obviously I'm going to show you some gameplay in a second. Caveats. Is it great? Yes. Game plan is all about getting that Breakery down nice and early. We're short on traps. There's only five in the deck as it stands, so you have to be really careful for your Reordain. This list runs Simless and can play Waylays with Vanadane. No Alyssa, though, so you have to bear that in mind. It's a really powerful deck. It's strong into long rounds. Really good against... Uh, Skelliger with all that removal because they lose a lot of value in it, but also against Nilfgaard Poison because, again, they're only removing low value units. Take a look and see how I play. Is this the final version of this deck? No. There's definitely some nuance in there. A couple of cards that need tweaking or moving around. I'm not playing the Heist version. I think Heist is a bit win more ish. Uh, so I'm not the biggest fan of that, albeit I'm not saying Heist, Breakery isn't amazing because it clearly is um or could be i don't know either way this was a lot of fun i hope you enjoy it as much as i enjoyed playing it that this is deck two of the patch already next on my mind we have been looking at skelliger with those funeral boats we tried a golden necker version it was interesting but i think skelliger pirate warrior hybrid is probably the way to go there that's probably going to be the next deck list that you see on youtube but what do you want to see? Let me know in the comments down below which faction, and preferably which archetype you'd like, and maybe, just maybe, I'll reply and let you know that you are the one. As always, I appreciate you greatly for being here. I hope you enjoy this as much as I do. Love you, my friends. Enjoy. Shame for them. Um, it is what it is. Elves. So uh, my strategy there in terms of what I was doing, I was trying to push and trade up. Having, knowing that they're a Demoven deck means that they're going to play specials, right? Um, oh boy, this this is a matchup that Elves can win. Because uh, a lot of their poison value is lost, right? A lot of their poison value can be lost uh, in the fact that my units are low of value. Let's say that okay, all of my traps are here, except for the one that I'm looking for. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to have to open Breakery, which I don't really love. Obviously, we were, we were hoping for Sticky Situation. Um... Yeah. Finding a way to consistently draw this for round one, I think is going to be important for this list if it's going to do well. Opponent just playing that, double jamming. Oh, boy. Fun. Fun. Love that. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's see what they think. Because this is really awkward with traps now. This could be a sticky situation, in which case they don't want to play a four. It could be this, which unfortunately it is. Um, okay, we, we want to kill the pikeman, though. Um, question is, do I just... Tell you what, this. Oh. Pointy-eared clumsiness again. For the daisy. 
There we go. I think that's worth it. I was completely forgetting, of course, that this isn't going to target this, but the fangs of the Empire. Um, they won't hold those bleeds. I should always have used the bowman there. It's really frustrating. That's four points of failure. Good job, me. A problem best solved. Right. Unfortunately, the downside here is we are blue coin. Um, and we're a little bit bullyable on blue coin, honestly. Unless I reordain to thin. If I reordain to thin, I am grabbing sticky situation. It's a bit late in the day, but... Willing. Losing against this in round one could be tough. Um... Been offered a pass, though. Why have you played this melee row? What? What? Is this doing on the melee row? Okay. I'm very inclined to pass now. With the hand I have, we resist the bleed pretty well. Anything I miss, reordain, trap, plus units, grabs. So... Okay. I'll take the pass. Hey, Dosen, good evening. How you doing? Hello, Lana. How are you doing? How are you doing, my friend? Uh, look at that. Okay. I can live with this. And we can resist this bleed pretty well, I think. Okay. They don't have a target. The Masquerade Ball's not that great. And I can kill this. Any place we can watch the community tournament Ari and I are hosting? Yes, there is! It's going to be live on mine and potentially both of our channels, actually. Uh, so you'll be able to watch in both places, my friend. Uh, both places. Kafka, we're desperately trying to sort one out. Yeah, we really want to set one up again. We're just kind of struggling for time. Um... To set one up, if that makes sense. That's our biggest problem. Um, but yes, if, uh, Revia here. And Kafka, definitely. Okay, we're trading scenarios. There was a temptation to Serpent Trap, honestly. Um, but we'll see. Okay. Fine. Oh. Okay, well that usurp is bad, because it's not going to proc for you. Am I ever... <laughs> grabbing Vanadane here. I think I'm grabbing Vanadane. Unironically. That's really annoying. FYI. Um... Uh, Ed is, how you doing? Good to see you. But yeah, we're definitely um, we're definitely keen to do another one. There's loads of things we want to watch, loads of board games we want to play. Um, like online and stuff, so yeah, it's um, just trying to find the time for it, honestly, is our biggest uh, issue. Okay, here comes Ron Pally. And he obviously can 
Lock, Poison, and Spy. Oh boy. It's a lot of points. In order to catch you up. This deck's really good and I'm enjoying the patch. Well, this deck's interesting. Uh, but I am really enjoying the patch so far. Golden Necker Pirates. That was curious. Uh, we were playing Golden Necker Pirates. Um, and having fun with it. No error. And it's... Like, that version's not right. It was just an idea. Um, and I, th I don't think it's worth it. Um, to be honest. Now I'm going to need to... Do this. Into... This. And this. I have to play the sticky situation up here, which sucks. This here. These are going to go back. And... Punch Rompali. Fine. I should have kept the movement, actually. Right now, this is bad. Oh, no, that sticky situation. Never mind, we're good. That's good. Just whether opponent plays into it now. Uh, but yeah, what have you been playing so far, Edis? What have you been, uh... What have you been up to? Your daughter came back for a two-day camp. Oh, nice, Lana! That's awesome! I love that. Oi! What you doing? Okay, we're happy with that. Are they going to play a special? Are they actually going to play a special here? Okay, the pass is really bad for us. Because we are a long way behind. This is now a three. And I can make it a four. Um, I don't think Simless catches. He's going to play for six, 14, 15, 16. 20 takes me to 59. Oh, no, wait, we can do it. Okay. Simless does catch. Kill this. Hit this. Um, burn. And then one. Two. Whew! Just, 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 we make it out. Um, the sad thing is we don't have too many points now. Um, but yeah, we make it out. Played Ogroids. Ogroids are really fun. Uh, I really like them. I think they're great. Okay. This is a seven. This is a five. Okay. So we just open with deception. Makes most sense to me. Um, a lot of their value is going to be lost, theoretically. Um Excellent. I hope to NR King uh it's my it's so far yes. So far it feels like the craziest. So far, it definitely does. Beautiful. I'm so tired. Nice. Okay. Sir. The question now is, Verno, if I play this now, Verno, in theory, 
it's just not better, right? I should just stay as slow and uninteractive as I can. We're ahead by a good chunk. This will die when I play it. Ooh, that's nasty. <clears throat> you love to see it, and elves is good. Bill Gafords ain't gonna help you now, Chief. And we double their points in the round three. Elves can be really scary in that shot, in that situation, right? Poison is one of the matchups that should be very winnable. You could see the reach that we have, especially now that Brikri improves every dead eye. It's a lot. Right? Like, a lot of extra value. No, it wasn't. Uh, I know you've been working super hard recently, and our schedules sadly don't collide so much right now. I'm sure that, uh, like, mine and Arya's schedules currently are a lot based around being in different countries and flying a lot. But, both of us are very hopeful, obviously, when we live together, that, that will be different. Uh, well, it will be different when we live together, is probably the best way to put it. We'll have a different streaming schedule where both of us probably stream at the same time a lot of the time. Um, because A, it will free up a lot of our own spare time as well, uh, but it will also mean we'll have a different streaming schedule, and we're both very much looking forward to that. So, yes. That might mean we get to hang out a bit more as well, which would be good, huh? Okay. They're ready for it. Yeah, we miss you too. We miss you too. Uh, how's your employer's time watching us? Psychoki, we appreciate that. that. That's good energy right there. Um, you just played against me close game, GG. Were you the Nilfgaard player, my friend? If you were the Nilfgaard player, I'm, I, I, I'm sorry. I love the deck you're playing. One of my absolute favorites. Um, it, I've got one very similar that I built ready for this season. I love Admiral Ron Pally. I'm just a terrible matchup for you because I go wide. Um, so, yeah, obviously I'm a... I'm an awkward matchup for your list, um, so sorry about that. Um, but yes, it's it's a really fun deck. I've been, I've built something kind of similar, um, and I I really like the idea. Like Mayamon built one. I'm guessing yours is based on Mayamons from a few seasons ago, um, which is what mine's based on. Uh, I shan't pretend. That's exactly what mine's based on. So, but yes. Um, Nice. How much Gwent since? <laughs> oh no, Zoe. Did we get you hooked on Call of Dragons? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'll try and get sponsored to play something else instead. How's that? <laughs> oh dear. That's not what you want to see, huh? That's that's not how you want it to go. Um, the risk is when I play this, they pass and it sucks for us, but... You th oh, you thought all three would get the statuses. No, it's three. The first one gets the one, the second one gets the second, the third one gets the third. Yeah, if he did, if the if all three got all three, mm -mm. I think the issue you had, round one, I think you gave me too much to get out. The um, the Philippe Van Morlehem is probably the best card in your deck. Um, it's so good. And yeah, at least you know now, eh? At least you know now. Um... Nice, Zoe. Okay. That's not too bad at all. That's You know what? That could be a lot worse, my friend. That could be a lot worse, huh? Nilfgaard rarely wants to give this round up. Because um, this is Nilfgaard's soldiers, but they have given the round up. Which means... So I now have to click this, which sucks for us. I need 20 points. Uh, Philippe for round three. Yeah, Phil in, if you have Philippe in round three, I'm screwed. So I don't have a... I have to deal with Philippe. He gives statuses every single turn, and those statuses stack with other statuses. He closes down engines. He... Like, Philippe is terrifying. Um, 
Crushing and leader. Is it enough? It's Ten. Four. Eight. It's, it's, yeah. Oh, no, I didn't need all of it. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's so bad. Why do I always forget that she exists? I only need, I could have kept one. Um, yeah, yeah, it's an amazing, it's a really fun deck. Uh, if you queue into Ogroids, they should just escape enter. Um, it's, it's just, it, they should just leave. Okay, that's great. The only problem is I don't have a trap in hand. I, sorry, the only problem is I don't have a trap in hand. Okay, so... Mm. Yeah, I think I'm willing to go here. We're gonna play. Uh, yeah, I never count Aelorin and I'm... You can tell how long it's been since I've played Elves, right? Aelorin, must remember her. Battle Rush and Patch Week is, is rough. I don't know how many people will be playing Battle Rush, I guess, is the only thing, right? Because it's Patch Week. Um, hmm. Okay, Twitch has just gone mad. Second game with the deck. Um, first one was against Oak. Yeah, they should forfeit half. Honestly, that's just an auto loose. It, there's no. It's for them. That's a near impossible matchup. I played it just before. They have no control. They have to beat you round one, push you super hard round two, get everything out, and then still survive round three. Like short point slam for them that you might still be able to remove. Like. It's a horrendous matchup for them. A bordering on unwinnable, I would say. Uh, like, that's like 90 10. Um, so. Oh, this is a problem, though. Because I want to play the Vanadane. But playing the Vanadane, I'm guessing I'm, only, I'm playing Vanadane for just. This is our land, Dwarf. I'm not getting rid of any of these, so... Nice. We'll play this as well. And this is specifically a trap, not an artifact. I'm willing... I'm... Ooh. Am I willing to Simless to kill this? So, in... Our situation, I'm a swarm deck, so typically a lot of my points are on low value units spread all over the board, and a lot of it then is in damage on your side. Poison struggles against that, because you want to poison tall, high value units and get rid of my points, but that's much harder to do when my points are all over the place, right? It becomes a lot harder. I think I have to Simless here to Thin to try and find value for the uh, Riordan. Opponent is Peppa Pig, yep. But we're gonna go double waylay here because we have your boy on the game on the board. Just for sheer point value. And then yeah. Uh, opponent is literally Pepper, yes. <laughs> literally Pepper. Out here. They're trying to block the front row, smart. Yeah, killing my dead eyes with poison sucks for you because they're they're four points, right? Whereas in plenty of like in ogres, you're killing tens, twelves, twenties. Um, so you're getting so much more value. Oh. Oh, no. Suck. I'm thirty points ahead here, but Verno right now is playing for five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. It's twenty-one points. In theory, but I could lose half of that in armor. We're so far ahead right now that it feels like if I might. It's just worth it. Okay, and we remove two units. That's pretty great. I can hit a third um, and clear it. If I had a trap on board, we would be 2 zeroing this all day and twice on Sunday, you know? 
close shot you lose on. Uh, the new elf card at the start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's a lot. He's so much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and turns commander back on too. Yeah, true. So they sh they're obviously still stacking for their own um, Triss, but they probably are just better off hitting me at this stage. Obviously, we're passing now. I'm not going to waste this. Uh, they jam the Afan. Yeah, the fact that you get it every single game is it's so much value now for elves, yeah. Uh, this is like my day one version of this deck. So there's a lot more... Uh, They get out. Oh, they do not get out and we win 2-0. Love to see it. Unlucky Pepper. There's a bit more. Um, and you kind of want to root for all of them. And that's really tough because they're all, they're all lovely. They're all so great that it's really tough. This is our first fight against Onslaught. You have... Um, as in, when you say you don't, you mean you don't have them in your collection or you don't run them? Um, yes, you run Calvate, that's right. I don't run Calvate in that deck because it's not consistent enough. I don't have enough tactics, personally. Um, this is really... So the Onslaught deck, I think this is going to be super strong. Okay, that in hand is great. Perfect. Let's go! Woohoo! Yeah, we open Breakery as usual. That's what they call me. That's what they call me. And I probably want Sticky Situation down as quickly as possible, actually. I think that's fair. That, that's a good point. The new bronzes that move stuff up in the deck are actually. And they're really great. I haven't incorporated those yet, but I feel like I'm going to. Um, but then I suppose if you've got those, you don't need the Calvate, right? Potentially. Because um, Calvate in round two forced you into a rough spot. Um, because then you had to play the round two, which you probably which you didn't really want to because it ended up costing you a card. And you ended up losing. I had one more card than you in round three. That's not the situation you want to be in, right? Um, mm hmm. Okay. Two. Put both of those away for a moment and start doing some work. Uh, I have to run some agents, no, only Aris Yes, I would say so. It, like, th that's the version I'm running, but it, it's by no means the best version, okay? Like, I haven't really played much with it this season. Um, you see, new ST, it's so much fun. Elves is really enjoyable. I'm not sure if we're, like, because again we're Swarm, we might be okay into this because they're gonna over, like, they're gonna lose a lot of value in their removal against us. So this isn't a bad matchup for us. So it's very, very the new traps and stuff kind of change the way you play this. You're not waylay simless anymore. More often than not, you're going for backup plans. Um, oh, they're playing Arborage, okay. Cute. Smart. You're more than welcome and thank you for dropping in. I appreciate it. Sticky situation could be really bad um, in some spots, right? Because your opponent has to flip it. Like, that doesn't flip it, for instance. I could be tempted to catch here. I think I want to bite. 
Pray not ignorant. Remember to whom you speak. So that's a five. That's more. Crap, you played this round. There isn't an enemy unit with one or less power. However, there is a Dolbathana Archer. Now we will see who is weak. Time for you to die. Amazing. Not a head here sucks. And I think it sucks so much. Yeah, Waylay is still there, right? Waylay is still there. Oh, again with this. Oh, okay, chat, I need you to remind me that Aileron exists. Round one's foul blood, Mr. Opponent. Round one, foul blood. Round one, foul blood. Wow. Keeps me ahead. Okay, that's not ideal, but... but this sticky situation has just been terrible for us. They haven't played anything that's proccing it at all. It needs to be a unit that's four or less power. And so for this deck, the ones they do run... Why is there an Armorsmith in Graveyard? This card's nuts. Uh... Okay. So they kind of have a pass, obviously. But if they want the pass, we're all right with it. I'm on 20. I need 10. This is hand buff 6. So I could very easily just hand buff the Dragoon and be all right. For instance. But I'm willing to... I've got three more cards I'm willing to play here. Um, that's amazing. We finally get this to proc. Mm-hmm. Wait. Oh, the deployability prevents it from counting. Yikes, that's really bad. Um, okay. Whoops, a daisy. <laughs> okay, I can still very much catch here. So, in the event they think I can't, I'm more than happy, right? More than happy to play to catch here. Let's see what they do. We get foul blood. The problem is going to be that they'll bring. Ooh, Ketrol. And there's the blacksmith. This is going to be a lot of points. They have 13 points. So that's a 15 point armor smith already. This card is kind of bonkers. At five. Gotta be honest. Getting rid of that is amazing for us. Um, Kertrold is so good as a card. So, so good. Um, second. So, they will want to push me here. Okay, not great. Not great. They should want to push us here, and they. I'm great. Okay. Let's see what they do, shall we? Play something big, opponent. That's bad. As news goes for us, that's pretty poor. But, on the plus side, 
That helps. I'm gonna have to use Reordain to get out here. I don't think there's any way around that. Um... Okay, Stormson. But I can get rid of worse options, right? That's at least 15. Look, what? Yikes. Did you see the points on that? And whatever's in their hand is probably a 15-point murder boat. This is bonkers. Okay, so... What do I need to play? Deception is an 8 because I don't have enough turns. And Crushing Trap is even less. So I have to... But this is still better. Right? And this. Okay. So, we get out. It's no problem. We have a lot of points. All I gotta do is find the scenario. Um, again, they lose... Like, if I'm something else, the amount of value they lost there was massive. Like... The removal value just kept vanishing because we are what we are. I need to- there's ya boy! Alright, now... I think I just have to suck this up. But I don't think I'm winning with these cards, is the issue. I need these cards, but I also need to definitely proc. And three of six... Three of six- oh, ah, Neither of us have leaders. They've given me all of their armor value, all of most of their strength, I would say. Um, obviously, Fukusha would destroy us right now, and odds are they found everything. Cat, does this fit Fukusha? Probably. Okay, they. Heat wave. Are you kidding me? They have a heat wave in this deck? There's no shot that's right. The amount of damage and removal you have. Okay. Opponent needs 13 points here. And they only have 11 of them. Let's go! Oh boy, I could have lost that very easily. That was very, very losable, chat.